Hi, my name's Sonia, um, and I'm part of the Generation to Generation Mentorship Program. This is my first blog entry, and it's about my goals for the program. So the main question that I had when I started this program is how is theater made? Um, it seemed like everyone that I sort of worked with in the theater world had a different way of making theater. I mean, going to Sarah Lawrence College, which is very experimental, <laughs> we would have it had a lot of different experiences with theater. Like, I don't know, I remember going into rehearsal and I'd be like, okay, now like lay on the floor and like roll around and sing. And when you bump into someone, you have to harmonize and only sing when you're on your back. And like, that was part of the show. <laughs> Or, like, I have memories of um, going into rehearsal with Ernest Abuba, who's, like, this very small Asian man <laughs> with a dent in his head, and he would just go up to you and he'd be like, Grah! and you would just kind of stand there and be like, Grah! and he'd be like, no, like, less, uh, and more, uh. and that was, <laughs> that was how we would block and create rehearsals. So I was very curious as to how people came upon the different ways that they made theater and I had worked with Simone in the past and his approach is very like egalitarian it's very like everyone comes in like we would have assignments every week so this week you have to make reference to the moon and include a slow rip and use this much amount of text or whatever and then people would come in with these little small segments of theater and then then they would sort of combine two different people's um, moments, theatrical moments that they had made, and that was how we created the piece. But at the same time, at school I was working on this production and it was very, just like the complete opposite. We had this script, it was Chekhov, it's been written a hundred years ago, or whenever Chekhov was alive, I don't know. And like the first week of rehearsal, she blocked the entire show, it was like very like, you walk and then you say this part of the line there and then that part of the line there and then that part of the line over there and like that was how we made the show. And it was just very confusing to me because I talked to a lot of theater artists and I mean most of them say, you know, I went to drama school and then I met so and so and they hired me and this person hired me and this is how I got where I am. But like how is it possible that they came from they got to such different conclusions on how to make theater? So that was my main goal, that was my main question. How is theater made and why? And what brought them to that place of creation?